From Winterton, the legends travelled up to the Nambichi Reserve outside Ladysmith to help our friends at Springbok Lodge spread some winter cheer. The whole reserve at Springbok Lodge, of course, for them to reach out to the community, it'll make their relationship even stronger, you know, because, um, well, for us, um, Nambiti happens to be the actual main employer of the local people. So for them to take this initiative, it's just showing that uh, uh, they, they do care and, and are aware of, uh, of the current uh, situation that the whole country is actually facing. I must thank Springbok Lodge first for agreeing to, to have us and buying into to our idea, what we'd like to do up here. SRA Rugby Legends have got a fantastic relationship with Springbok Lodge. We've had that relationship for a long time now. And the two trailers that are full of sweet potato and onions that have also come up, uh, that's from SA Harvest and Lindsay, so we thank Lindsay as well. We recently joined hands with um, the rugby legends down in KZN, based out of the Sharks Rugby Stadium. Uh, SA Harvest our national food rescue organisation. Um, we tend to take food that is diverted from landfill and give it to um, community, communities in need. Um, we've come together in an, a rural outlying area to give communities that are outside of the city centres um, some food that should last them for about a month or so. It's a mixture of dry goods and we've provided the fresh produce. Um, so we've got um, onions and um, sweet potatoes and bananas out in the, in the vans, which we will soon be taking out to the communities close by. Um, we've all just found ourselves in a, in a tricky situation with looting and with COVID. Um, so all of us uh, NPOs are coming together and trying to link link hands nationally as well. So we've had food coming in from Cape Town and Joburg and all over KZN, and then we're redistributing it from Central Points. It's always great to have Pat Lambie join us. It's lovely to be out here um, just outside Nambiti Game Reserve and uh, with the SA Rugby Legends Initiative and a bunch of sponsors on board, um, handing out some food parcels to some community members here. Um, it's been awesome to connect with, uh, with some friends and then it's very special to see the difference uh, a small food parcel and some basic supplies it can make to, to someone's life. The Nambiti Game Reserve is just outside Ladysmith and there's a local community which actually owns the reserve as well as Springbuck Lodge. We've got a fantastic working relationship with the community and since the unrest and COVID and all that so many people have lost their jobs yeah, and it was a great initiative of these of the rugby legends and everybody involved to ask Springbuck Lodge to be included. Just now we'll be heading out to go and dish them out to the local community. We were delighted to partner with them and be able to come alongside them and offer the food hampers. So in each of the hampers, um, being able to put items that have been donated to the Domino Foundation and uh, be able to distribute it to the communities. Most of the people are on, um, on, on layoffs. Some have gotten um, retrenched because of uh, shortage of work. And uh, I know on my, on my side, uh, we are actually on short time. Um, so we've got half of the staff in and the other half is basically at home on an unpaid leave type of thing. So an, an initiative like this one uh, goes a long way, definitely to those who have no income at the moment. CMH have been great supporters to Sala in the past year. Um, we've been partnered with the SA Rugby Legends for this year and it's a great opportunity for CMH Group to be with the community and we're helping the community um, and feeding them and it's a, it's, a great, it's a great initiative and to be part of. Luazi Mvovo was enjoying his time. I haven't seen Pet uh, and Keegan in a while, um, so to drive up here with them and, and still um, chat about the old uh, days where we were in the field. And, and now we're coming together for, for, for something that we, we're very happy to do and something we're passionate about, and, and that's giving back um, to the community. And obviously with the Springbok Lodge being involved also, um, we're going to go on a game drive and, and just have fun um, around this community, which uh, is very beautiful. Yeah, it's wonderful to be at Nambiti and to be hosted at Springbok Lodge. Um, it's really not hard work at all to pack some food parcels and interact with, um, with people in the community and, and then also be able to enjoy a game drive um, and beautiful Burma dinner this evening. So um, this has really been a treat and something um, 
yeah, which hopefully SA Rugby Legends will continue to do along with all the partners and sponsors um, because uh, it's a win-win-win for, for everyone involved. A big thank you to all our partners who helped contribute to the food drop. SA Harvests, the Domino Foundation, DSV and CMH as well as the Springbok Lodge for hosting us.